Mr. Speaker, yesterday, economics professor Peter Morisi of the University of Maryland and the Washington Times cited facts the American people need to know. Quote, President Obama would like us to believe that things are getting better every day, but average median incomes are down $1,650 on his watch. Elderly women are working in record numbers because pensions and retirement incomes are being decimated, and young folks are bogged down by student loans, can't buy homes, and face rocketing apartment rents. Should the economy tumble, Hillary Clinton will try to buy off voters with more Obama vintage free stuff that makes creating jobs in the private sector so tough. Expanding Obamacare mandated benefits will push up prices for drugs, medical services, and insurance premiums even more and cause employers to hire even fewer workers. Instead of more jobs, America will have more debt and more employers fleeing. America did not become a superpower by being timid, and it's time for a president who understands this. End of quote. In conclusion, God bless our troops, and may the president, by his actions, never forget September 11th and the global war on terrorism.